and I am super excited to discuss my top picks in the newest Hermes Women's Spring Summer 2022 collection launched recently. Plus, we will also look into the newest bag launch for next year. Well, surprisingly, there was no Kelly's or Birkins to be seen on this recent launch. So are you ready to see what Hermes has to offer this coming season? For those of you new, hello, my name is Loki and I enjoy talking and sharing about luxury. Well, mostly about Hermes and I love chatting about leathers and how to care for them. Well, it would mean the world to me if you subscribe and join my channel. Do remember to hit that bell to get regular updates. Okay, grab your cup of tea, let's spend some time looking at my top picks in this collection. I am blown away with this gorgeous pea coat with the accented leather trims. The detailing around the collar area with that buckle detail is quite unique and I see this horse bridle inspiration running through a few pieces in this collection. Well, the grey is such a beautiful colourway and can be dressed up or down either way. I also love the gathered details at the back, which is such a lovely surprise. Now, the next gorgeous piece is this coat, which to me looks like the Toile Birkin with caramel leather trims. I love this laid-back yet casual look and how it is draped on the model. Now, this shift dress is something I would love to have and I really adore the retro vibe it is giving off. The symmetry of the dress and the leather trims coming down the front spells effortless chic. Well, another gorgeous coat is this number in caramel tones with the same barcode detailing at the collar. Well, interestingly, I've also decided to wear something quite similar, but this piece is from Zara and it's got the same um, horse brittle thingy going on here. So, you know, just to fit in the thing today. Now we see the appearance of a new bag in this collection, which I am so excited to share. From what I read, this beautiful barrel-shaped hospit bag in blue voluto is the sex voxelous. Well, this hardware logo is the handle itself, and from what I read, there is a concealed thin shoulder strap that goes through the space between the ends of the hospit. I mean, it is quite tough to imagine how that would work out, but I would have preferred them showcasing the sling version on the models. From what I saw, there was about 7 colours that were showcased on the launch, which I will put the photos up here. The colours I really, really love are the dark brown one with gold hardware and the grey light colour with palladium hardware. I can certainly see that this is the, see this as a bag for events or something that you can carry from day to night because it's, such a, it's a sling option, so it is quite casual. Another bag that was showcased in this collection is the Moss de Bright, which is a slick shoulder bag. From what I gather, it is certainly an adjustable strap which what looks like a metallic snap closure. I managed to catch a glimpse of three colorways, which is the mustard color, the dark brown, and another in the 12 version with leather trim color contrast. Well, I almost left out the Poche en Place, which looks like a pochette carried in a crossbody style. This bag is so sleek with clean crisp lines. Moving back to the ready to wear, this jumpsuit with a metallic glossy sheen is one of my favourites and it looks amazingly comfortable. Another gorgeous piece is this mermaid looking skirt with scale like details. I love the way how the scales flow with the way she sashays down the catwalk and it isn't very body hugging as well which is quite forgiving in its silhouette. Overall, I thoroughly enjoyed this season's launch of ready to wear and the unique barrel shaped Mopsimus bag though I was a bit disappointed not seeing any Kellys or Birkins on the launch. Initially, I was kind of expecting them to impress, to impress us with the mycelium leather also known as the Hermes Sylvania, done in a Birkin, Kelly or a Picotin. After all, we have seen and read all about it in the news. Well, I guess that would be something worth looking forward to next season. Thank you for watching to the end and let me know your thoughts about the three new bags in the Hermes line. Before you go, I would appreciate if you subscribe to my channel and join my family. Take care and goodbye ladies.